at this time, okay, the intuitive download I received is that people are really noticing that you've made a lot of changes in your life, okay? Temperance out first. You have brought about confirmation. You have brought about a lot of inner healing within yourself, okay? Possibly overcoming conflict. And most importantly, you were going through a conflict with yourself, okay? I feel like you guys had two roads to choose from and for a lot of you, you were keeping yourself stagnant by being in a mindset of like a lack mindset or feeling like you weren't confident enough to go after your dreams. And people are noticing if you took a period of time to yourself to isolate, how much you've matured, how much you were coming out of that whole mindset that you can't and stepping into a prosperous time in your life where you can, okay? You can go after the things you want. You can go after the relationships you want. And yeah, you could be a Sagittarius or you could have a Sagittarius around you that's of importance to you guys. And if not, this just represents total balance. Hello, I am Earth Angel 111. If you're new here, go ahead, like the video, subscribe, get a hop right into it. So yeah, next card is Knight of Swords. In the past, I think people feud you as someone who would generally run away from things that challenged you, okay? So instead of like being up for a challenge, or, you know, trying something new that was outside of your comfort zone, you were typically just running away from said feelings and you weren't allowing yourself to like heal and overcome situations where you may have felt hurt in the past. But now, look at this, okay? We've got the five wands in reverse. So running away from feeling like you're not good enough. Seven of wands in the upright, okay? So really meditating and honing in on that energy and queen of pentacles, okay? So y'all are getting to it. You guys are so much more focused now. You could either be a fire sign or an earth sign that resonates with this. Regardless of the sign, people see you as someone who's extremely stable, okay? You've really gotten your emotions together. And maybe in the past, people viewed you as someone who really was like going through it, okay? Maybe you didn't even realize how much you were going through it, but it was visible to other people. And now, if you found this message, people are viewing you as someone who's really reinvented themselves, you've matured, you've grown, and most importantly, you popping out looking good because of this whole inner healing that you've done within yourself. And you could actually be inspired recently to have started doing some type of meditation, yoga, hot yoga, however it resonates, maybe even going to the gym for some of you. People are noticing, okay? It really shows how much you've totally taken the time to possibly take a step back from a few people for a bit and work on the healing. And so now you're about to pop out looking good. Some of you may already have. People are noticing. You guys are really getting your game together. You're getting your life together. And more importantly, you're getting your mental together, okay? And people really appreciate you for that. I feel like in the past, you could have definitely been someone who went through a lot of self-doubt. You know, people probably viewed you then as confident, but you went through so much self-doubt. You could have held yourself back from certain situations, certain careers, certain relationships or friendships subconsciously, okay? And now people are saying you're starting to own who you are, starting to love who you are, and more importantly, you're not afraid to put yourself out there. And previously, maybe this was like five years ago, five months ago, however it resonates, you could have been really introverted or kind of like tiptoeing around taking the steps in your life that you wanted to take. People are viewing you as someone who's making a major comeback in your life, and y'all looking good while you're doing it, okay? And most importantly, with this pentacle card, regardless if you're feminine or masculine, people are viewing you as incredibly grounded. So you could have just went through a period where you're like reconnecting with old friends or wanting to. If that's the case, spirit's saying go for it, okay? There are some people that maybe you haven't communicated with in a while based on you going through this inner healing and there's people that miss you out there, especially with this being in reverse, y'all. Could be up to five people you used to be extremely close with are missing your energy, okay? And if not, this could be that fire sign energy there with the, the temperance. If not, that could be this fire sign energy here with the temperance, okay? Someone's really missing your energy, missing the way that you guys used to communicate, hang out. Um, for some of you, maybe this was someone you used to do meditation, yoga with. But yeah, people are viewing you as like you're turning a new page, a new chapter in your life, and one that you should be extremely proud of yourself for. And I feel like a lot of you guys are about to step into this major awareness, okay, of why you had to go through everything you did, and more importantly, like where you're headed to next. 
So let's see. Wow, four of pentacles. So a lot of you in the past, maybe you were more focused on your career, okay? Or what moves you wanted to make in the future. Spirit showing you, you can not only have to hold on so tightly to things. Because when you do, you don't allow yourself to manifest and prosper, okay? If you're holding on tightly to the idea of having to overwork yourself, or more importantly, of what career path to take next, you're not allowing things to just flow. So I feel like the universe is trying to show you Y'all can do it. You guys just need to let go and let God, most importantly, because Divine has an amazing plan in store for you. And a lot of you are about to be pleasantly surprised with where the trajectory of your life is about to head. Page of Wands. You could definitely be a fire sign. And if not, this just represents major intuition and most importantly, major passion. So follow your heart. Whatever you're passionate about, the career will flow with that. A lot of you guys are looking to reposition yourselves in a career, a dream field, something you've always wanted to do. It's about to happen. And it's all going to be when you decide not to give up on yourself, y'all. Okay. Some of you, this could be a new contract as well. Something that's going to make you feel incredibly free. Wow. And incredibly appreciated and valued. Look at that. Those are the next couple of cards. And y'all saw me shuffle. Look at all that energy. Passion, passion, passion. More passion, more energy. Put the passion into it, okay? And the finances will come. Facts proven. Thank you, spirit. Like, seriously. <laughs> so a lot of you, maybe you're creative types. You could be looking to become an influencer, a dancer, a model, a singer, okay? Something to do with music could be relevant. If you're having a hard time getting a project off the ground, people can pick up on your energy, okay? So the more that you focus on loving yourself and being confident and standing in knowing who you are and healing, okay? The more that it's going to be able to be seen. And for some of you, you may have a contract coming in you don't see. I feel like in the past, you could have almost had a contract coming in, but because you needed to do that healing, God said, hold on, wait a minute, let's give you a timeout, okay? So some of you just went through a period of feeling like you were put on timeout, divine put you on timeout. Now you've done the inner work, you're healing, and you're ready for a new journey. Some of you may be traveling, okay? This may be a offer to travel somewhere new for a new job and get ready. Spirit saying you don't see this coming, but with some of you, you could see this coming. If you do have intuition at all with that Ace of Wands, it's almost like you guys manifested this new outcome for yourself, so get ready. Okay, I feel like world travel is of significance, um, traveling to a different state, city, country, continent, okay, definitely overseas for a lot of you. So this may be a dream job, something you've always wanted. And yeah, it's going to be a big offer as well, okay? A lot of you guys really don't see this coming. And Spirit's saying you had to do the inner work first before you're ready to be able to invest all your mindset into something in specific as well. Because if it is a creative project, Y'all needed to be good in order to manifest creativity, new ideas, right? And maybe in the past you were feeling stuck and stagnant too because you had some inner healing to do. But yeah, a lot of people are seeing you as someone who's just overcame a lot. And I feel like it was just a lot of internal battles. Did you want to follow a path? Did you want to follow a different path? Or for a lot of you, maybe it was something you didn't speak about, but you battled with the idea, were you good enough to have said dream? The answer is yes, okay? Spirit doesn't just give us a dream for us to not have. And now that you've done the inner work, you probably regained your confidence because a lot of people are seeing it. And there could be a brand or company in specific that wants to work with you that sees that. And yeah, it was all about the inner conflict within you, okay? You were going through it more than other people realize because you could also be someone who has a hard time expressing when you're struggling, Um in your 3D life or just like internally, okay, with your confidence, with your ideas, whatever this could be. A lot of people didn't see exactly how much you were going through because you kept a lot of it in. So one lesson to learn as well is to be able to open up more to other people and be a little more expressive when you feel like you're having a hard time in life. Because the people that love and care about us are there to help us, okay, not make us feel alone. And a lot of you do this whole thing where you may self isolate. Okay, so that's a lesson that Spirit wanted you to learn as well, possibly through isolation. Don't isolate so much, okay? Put yourself around people that truly love you and care about you, and all those mountains will seem like molehills. So if you found this reading, just know people are viewing you as someone who's done an extreme amount of inner work and you are looking fabulous. So keep it up. I'm Earth Angel 111. 
Thank you for watching. If it does resonate, go ahead, like the video, leave a comment. Until next time, bye y'all.